Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is a ministry of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Jacksonville, Florida. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The eternal gifts of Christ the King, the Apostles' glory, let us sing. And all with hearts of gladness raise, do hymns of thankful love and praise. Their faith in Christ the Lord prevailed, their hope a light that never failed. Their love ablaze o'er pathways trod, to lead them to the eternal God. In them the Father's glory shone, in them the will of God the Son. In them exults the Holy Ghost, through them rejoice the heavenly host. To thee, Redeemer, now we cry, that thou wouldst join to them on high, thy servants who this grace implore forever and forevermore. Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? Jesus replied, I am the way, the truth, and the life. I trusted even when I said I am sorely afflicted, and when I said in my alarm, no man can be trusted. How can I repay the Lord for his goodness to me? The cup of salvation I will raise. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people. O oh, precious in the eyes of the Lord is the death of his faithful. Your servant, Lord, your servant am I. You have loosened my bonds. A thanksgiving sacrifice I make, I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people. In the courts of the house of the Lord, in your midst, O Jerusalem. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? Jesus replied, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Thomas, who was called the twin, was not present when Jesus appeared to the apostles. So they told him, We have seen the Lord. Hallelujah! When the Lord delivered Zion from bondage, it seemed like a dream. Then was our mouth filled with laughter, on our lips there were songs. The heathens themselves said, What marvels the Lord worked for them! What marvels the Lord worked for us! Indeed, we were glad. Deliver us, O Lord, from our bondage as streams in dry land. Those who are sowing in tears will sing with when they reap. They go out, they go out full of tears, carrying seed for the sowing. They come back, they come back full of song, carrying their sheaves. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Thomas, who was called the twin, was not present when Jesus appeared to the apostles. So they told him, We have seen the Lord. Hallelujah! With your hand, touch the mark of the nails. Doubt no longer but believe. Alleluia. A reading from Ephesians chapter 1. Praise be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has bestowed on us in Christ every spiritual blessing in the heavens. God chose us in him before the world began to be holy and blameless in his sight. He predestined us to be adopted sons through Jesus Christ. Such was his will and pleasure that all might praise the glorious favor he has bestowed on us in his beloved. In him and through his blood we have been redeemed and our sins forgiven. So immeasurably generous is God's favor to us. God has given us the wisdom to understand fully the mystery, the plan he was pleased to decree in Christ. A plan he carried out in Christ in the fullness of time to bring all things into one in him in the heavens and on earth. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit 
as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. With your hand, touch the mark of the nails. Doubt no longer, but believe. Alleluia. A reading from Ephesians chapter 4. Christ gave apostles, prophets, evangelists, pastors, and teachers in roles of service for the faithful to build up the body of Christ till we become one in faith and in the knowledge of God's Son and form that perfect man who is Christ come to full stature. Tell all the nations how glorious God is. Tell all the nations how glorious God is. Make known His wonders to every people, how glorious God is. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Tell all the nations how glorious God is. I touched the mark of the nails with my fingers. I put my hand into His side and said, My Lord and my God, Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm and has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. I touched the mark of the nails with my fingers. I put my hand into his side and said, My Lord and my God, Alleluia. My brothers, we build on the foundation of the apostles. Let us pray to our Almighty Father for his holy people and say, Be mindful of your church, O Lord. Father, you wanted your Son to be seen first by the apostles after the resurrection from the dead. We ask you to make us his witnesses to the farthest corners of the world. Be mindful of your church, O Lord. You sent your Son to preach the good news to the poor. Help us to preach this gospel to every creature. Be mindful of your church, O Lord. You sent your Son to sow the seed of an unending life. Grant that we, who work at sowing the seed, may share the joy of the harvest. Be mindful of your church, O Lord. You sent your Son to reconcile all men to you through his blood. Help us all to work towards achieving this reconciliation. Be mindful of your church, O Lord. Your Son sits at the right hand of in heaven. Let the dead enter your kingdom of joy. Be mindful of your church, O Lord. Let us make our prayers and praise complete by offering the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Almighty Father, as we honor Thomas the Apostle, let us always experience the help of his prayers. May we have eternal life by believing in Jesus, whom Thomas acknowledged as Lord. For he lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.